so hey guys what's up and in this video we're going to see about what are basically the generic trees right so we are well familiar with the binary trees right so in a binary tree there is a root node and it has some of the child nodes and the child can be at most two right we can't have more than two childs but in generic tree we have n childs we can have n number of childs that may vary from 0 to n right but here we can also call generic tree as a nre tree right so the root node can have any number of nodes it likes and similarly the child of this can have any number of childs it can have it is not limited that it would have at most two as in for the binary tree we had only two right that means we would use left and right pointer but here we can't use always the left and right pointer because we have n number of nodes here so for that what you can use is we can use a vector of the pointers of the child right so what we can do is basically we have a vector of the pointers that will essentially point to the child right so it can be a variable length that is we have used a variable arrays that is a dynamic array in case of C++ we use vectors in case of Java we use array list so that's pretty much it for the generic trees we'll see you in the next video when we'll be doing a question on generic tree on the late code